Hey, oh, it's your boy Zach, and welcome to today's video. So today we are gonna build a DIY leaf blower go kart. I don't know why. I don't know how. I don't even know if this is gonna work or not, but I want to try it anyway. Okay, we're going to make this work. The idea came into my mind the other day. Like, it's just like you know, what if I build a lightweight go kart frame, stick a leaf blower on it, and just see what happens? <laughs> oh no. Okay, for a little bit of backstory as to why I finally decided to do this, you need to know a little bit about this leaf blower. So my dad bought this leaf blower about half a year ago, I would say, maybe a little longer, and it is one of the most powerful leaf blowers you can buy. Like, I don't know how much horsepower it has, but it's not like one of those cheap little leaf blowers that you buy from Walmart. No, 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 this is the real deal. This thing is extremely powerful. Apparently, the wind that blows out of the tube, you know, like that, the tube thing of the leaf blower, it, the wind exits, exits that tube at over 200 miles per hour. 200 miles per hour. So in theory now, that means that if I were to strap that onto a go-kart, it'll make a go-kart go 200 miles an hour. I mean, what could go wrong? So before we go any further, I just want to throw the obvious disclaimer. Please do not try this at home. I'm the one who's being an idiot around here, not you. This video is for your entertainment, okay? So in terms of basically what we're gonna do, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to build a go-kart frame, just a basic go-kart frame. I'm gonna try to make it as small and as lightweight as I possibly can. That way it's easier for the leaf blower to like propel me forward. You know what I mean? So, I mean, I guess there's nothing left to do but get started. I mean, let's not waste any time. Let's just go straight into it with the cinematics. Okay, so here it is. Here is the finished product. And, I mean, you know, it's not beautiful or anything. It is it is pretty rough around the edges and it is pretty ugly, but it's not meant to be beautiful. It's meant to be functional. We're after functionality, not beauty. This thing is pretty light too. It only weighs like uh, about 20 pounds, which is uh, pretty light. I mean, it's a decent size. Here's my shoe compared to it. It's a decent size. I even went the extra mile and added this brake lever. You know, you just pull it like this. And so if anything goes wrong, I can just pull it back and it'll scrape against the ground. And that's how you know that this is serious. It's when Zach FTW actually decides to put brakes on his go-karts. <laughs> okay, but no more messing around. It's time we actually do the real deal. We're gonna put the leaf blower on that thing and we're gonna see if this actually works. Honestly, I really don't know if it's gonna work or not, but we're gonna find out here soon. So yeah, more cinematics.
worked! I can't believe it actually worked! <laughs> I still can't believe it actually worked! That leaf blower managed to move this go-kart at a few miles per hour! That's actually impressive! One of my ideas actually worked! For once! <laughs> Although I will admit to something, I when I was riding, I did go on an ever so slight downhill. It was just a little bit though, so, so I kind of cheated a little bit, but not too much because I mean, it still worked really well. I even tried it on level ground and it still worked. I mean, that just goes to show how powerful that thing is. As far as what I'm gonna do with this go-kart, I honestly don't know. So let me know in the comments what I should do with that go-kart, should I? Should I sell it? Should I take it apart? Should I burn it? Should I eat it? Should I- I don't want to eat it. Don't- please don't take too much notice when I said that. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. If you did, make sure you give it a like because this video was so much fun to film. But anyways, guys, that's pretty much it for the video. Tell your friends, tell your family, let everybody know about me, Zach FTW. Stay awesome.